What time is it? Zipertastic time! Hooray! <laughs> What's up guys and welcome back to LEGO Dimensions and today we're going to be doing the Adventure Time Level Pack Level. I'm so excited for this. You might have seen earlier today we did the two for one level pack and team pack unboxing for LEGO Dimensions that had of course the level pack which is Finn and his wonderful companion of the Jake Mobile and also the Ancient War Elephant which will be spawning in whenever we need those. And then we also have Jake over here. Oh no, that's not Jake, hold on. Okay, we'll spawn in the lumpy car in just a second, hold on. <laughs> but we have Jake over here and his vehicle is, well it's Beemo actually, which is super cute. And then we have um, Lumpy Space Princess over here and she has the Lumpy Space Car. So that's pretty darn cool, but for right now, <laughs> throw on our cell phone. But for right now we're gonna go ahead and into the Lego Dimensions level. I'm super duper excited for it because it looks really darn cool. And yeah, we're gonna enjoy ourselves. I'm pretty sure we're gonna be doing most of it all in one episode. I don't really know how long it is, but hopefully it isn't super duper long. Maybe it'll be two episodes, but we'll find out together. Where is it though? Oh, I think I see it in the background. Actually, I'm not sure. Hmm, oh no, don't fall. Oh, wait, here it is, here it is, I found it. I found it, it looks so cool. It is the Adventure Time level. Let's head in. Oh, it's just like the intro, I love it. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's amazing. Oh, oh, hello! Hello, Princess Bubblegum. There's, there's Marceline. She's gonna be in a pack in November. Oh, they don't have the song. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> the butt wiggle. The best high five of all time! Or something like that. <laughs> Bye! Wait, where, where is he going? I don't know. But we're playing as Jake right now. Hey, wait up, dude! Door thing he broke again. Well, he's right here. Maybe we should just play as Jake for right now? Okay, see you guys. Maybe we'll just play as Jake for right now, just to sort of get a taste. This is what it's supposed to be like. But look at how this is sort of true to life when it comes to Adventure Time. It looks just like Adventure Time when in like 3D, you know? It looks really, really cool. I like it. But we're gonna have to break a lot of stuff here. Hopefully he's good at breaking studs. Oh boy, because we do have well, this actually this seems like it's open world, right? I don't know, this could be an actual level right now. Actually, yeah, it's gonna be a level. It's not the adventure world, I don't think. Only BMO is able to interact with BMO docking stations. Well, no problem, because we do have BMO. I'll load him up in a second. Oh, okay, it's uh, Bob, maybe his name is? I remember him from the episode. I think I watched up to season six, which was way back in the beginning of 2015. I haven't watched since. Ah, you probably could. All right, well, go ahead and do that kind of stuff in just a second. Hold on, hold on. Here, let me... Is this something I can build? Okay, oh yeah, that's right. He also has like a huge collection of swords, doesn't he? He has the, okay, first he has his crossbow. He has Scarlet, he has the demon sword. He has the fin sword. He has the grass sword and he has the root sword. So that's pretty darn cool. But we just need the crossbow for now. Just hit it like that and we're nice and well with that. So th this could be something that can be built. No, I want I want to build, I want to build. There you go. Ooh, got it. And then there's something else I could build here still. Yo, let's get those, actually let's get those studs before we get anything else. I don't know if we're in an open world area or not, so I wanna make sure I get some studs here before we head off. Cause I mean, we could be in the adventure world area. I don't I don't know if we're actually in the levels yet. Okay, so, okay, that was fine. Okay, this is very weird. It's like a, a one of those crazy machines. I love it, yay, it's open. Okay, so we'll do that in a second. Of course, let's spawn in BMO. Oh my gosh, if you guys wanna see me build BMO, go to the video that went up earlier today, yesterday, something like that. Oh, we can just get the ride on the back. Look at how cute he is. He's like, wee. <laughs> All right. Um, hmm. What is going on? Bug battle? Oh, we're playing a little game. Whoa, get the little yellow spiders, but look out for those big spiders. Oh my, get the little yellow spiders. Watch out for the big spiders. I don't know if we'll be able to fight them, but the goal is to get a few of them. Are we running out of studs? I hope the game's not taking my studs. Maybe it's a, oh no, oh no, 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 ow, ow, ow. Don't do that, don't do that. This is a little scary, actually. I saw a little yellow spider over here, right? Jeez, I don't know where they are. Uh, little yellow spiders. Hopefully you don't see the spiders in detail. I'd have to probably get arachnophobia warning on this video. Luckily, we're all good. Okay, they give us a little bit of extra time. It's like Pac-Man, but seemingly more difficult. Gotta be careful, though. I wonder if I can attack the spiders at all, or maybe that would damage me. Hmm. Oh, wait, 
I was saying it was down there. Oh, I found it, I found it. Got it, no, no, please don't. Um, Now it's down here, huh? All right then, so we should be able to do this, I think. Now that I know that it has an arrow that points you in the right direction. Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Don't turn, don't turn, don't turn. Oh no, oh no. Okay, got that, five. Now where are we going? I don't know where we're going, there's no arrow this time. Oh, there's a little yellow spider. Okay, come on, go, 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 go. Grab it. Oh, there's another one. Oh, that was lucky. That was really lucky. Oh no, 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 they got me, they got me, ow. Okay, so we're almost there, we're almost there. Come on, three. And then where else do I go now? Um, it has to be close by as if it hasn't told me, right? Oh no, it's down there in the bottom left. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> Luckily, they're missing. And then one more, one more, it's way up here. All right, let's go get it. Come on, run, run, run. This is cool though, I like it. We only got 12 seconds left to do it. I guess it's a little longer than a second. I guess however fast we do it will determine how many uh, studs we get out of it though. Which is a weird concept, but cool as well. Wait, where's it? Oh, it's right here. Come on, get it. And that's it, I got all of them. So that's gonna give me 10,000 studs. We win, yay. Better than nothing. Thank you, Bimo, and we're gonna get for it. Yeah, boy, <laughs> trophy earns. Thank you so much, Bimo. I appreciate it. So, what are we gonna do down here? Uh, ooh, okay, this is cool. All right, we're at a checkpoint. So let's pick up all this, and we don't have the stud meter anymore. Weird, okay, then I might not worry about the studs too much then. Where, what are we supposed to be doing around here? Where are we supposed to be going? Because I'm not really sure. Uh, is this buildable? Anything buildable around here? Oh my, it's just, I mean, we got mounds of gold, that's something. Okay, now we have a stud meter, and it's filling up. So, I'm gonna assume this is an actual level, which is pretty cool. Pretty cool indeed. Take all this, because I know sometimes even the level packs will start you off in the adventure area, right? Sometimes, sometimes not, maybe? I'm not really sure. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I don't know, I'm going crazy. How are you gonna get up? It's not like we're not out made in a Lego world made of things where you can build things forever and always. All right, get that. And what is that supposed to be? I guess it's a sword pusher. Oh no, it's wind. Yeah, yeah. I just love all of his voice acting. I don't know if he has original lines or anything, but I really hope he does. I mean, it seems like he does. All right, got that. We can't break in here though. Hmm. All right, get all this. Is this toasters? Get out of here, toaster. We don't need you right now. Well, this is cool. This has definitely been my most anticipated uh, level pack to date ever since they announced it. Besides this, I'm also super excited for the Sonic the Hedgehog one, but this one just looks so cool, you know? Because I've watched a lot of, you know, Adventure Time, like the first six seasons, which is a lot of seasons. I haven't, like, watched since then, because I know I need to catch up. I gotta catch up with everything. And I was busy all the time, you know? All right, so let's go ahead and eat this stuff up. And then... Okay, we just got a few more piles left over. And it looks like I can get up here, sort of. It's a little slippery. Hmm, no blue stud. Oh, how's there no blue stud around here? This is like super secret. All right, that seems to be about everything we could find here. But wait, what about this ladder? Okay, that didn't really have too much for us except for a purple stud. I'll take it, I will take it. So it looks like there's more buildable stuff up here. What is this? Uh. Oh my, <laughs> I have no idea what that was supposed to be, but it exploded. Um, So we can build with this. Oh, is it gonna be another hook shot? Looks like it. Ooh, hold on, hold on, we got studs everywhere, just bouncing all over the place. This makes it much more difficult to get the thing. Stop it, game, stop it. I just can't break, this thing's unbreakable, which probably means that I'll have a use sometime soon. Ooh, same thing with all these, actually. Ooh, there you go, that was good. So I'd love to hear, what is your favorite Adventure Time hero? Hopefully we see a huge array of different Adventure Time heroes here. I'm really hoping that there's like, you know, some cool stuff. Like, I was hoping we got the lemon guy, the unacceptable kind of guy. I forget how his voice sounds. It's been a while. We gotta, we gotta hit that from an appropriate angle. Just like that, yeah. And now we can go like that, yeah. It's like a vine that he's shooting out, which is pretty cool. Get down here, ker slam on this, ker slam on that, ker slam on everything. I don't know what's with these golden things that are unbreakable. Are they like, are they supposed to be gold? Maybe I can pull up a character that can destroy gold and that could be a thing? I'm not really sure. We'll try for 100% if we can get it, but I don't think we're gonna be able to get it. We never usually do. <laughs> I've only 100% in one Lego game and that was Lego Jurassic World, which we did on the channel. 
Okay, so what's going on with this? This is press circle one near sword switches and follow the on-screen arrow. All right then, so we already did this. Just like that, we're good. Give me that, oh, wait, you didn't give me the blue stud. A book and a bad guy. Ooh, this is cool. Everybody's dancing at Candy Town. Go nuts, go nuts like there's blood on your butts. <laughs> what? What's going on in the castle? Check it out. A magical globe? No, Finn, it's what you can see through the globe. Golly. <laughs> Look, you see this book? Yeah, I see it. It's called the Enchiridion. It's a book meant only for heroes whose hearts are righteous. Righteous. Schmauze out! The book lies at the top of Mount Cragdor, guarded by a manly minotaur. It's waiting for a truly righteous hero to claim it. That sounds you like us. You the goods, Bubblegum? Because I am into this stuff. Yeah, I know. And yes, I do. Then off I go. We. <laughs> math. Math? What about math? A buddy is high buddies. Young heroes to be. This mountain is called Cragdor. Its purpose is twofold: to protect the Enkai Ridian and to test the hearts of those who seek to possess it. Many noble challengers have entered, attempting to pass the grueling trials that lie beyond these walls. But no one has ever left here alive or dead. Only the truest, most worthy hero can receive the hero's Enkai Ridian and walk out these doors again. If it is you, friend, oh, and I cannot say that I am certain, Bye. but you are verily welcome to try. <laughs> Bye. However, first you must pass my riddle. Ooh, you've unlocked the riddle in the door. Oh, <laughs> brilliantly done, child. You've passed the first trial. I love the little yourself, stell. He's so cute. For there are many trials ahead of you, and each trial is more treacherous than the last. Oh, no. The door hit him on the way out. Oh. What you got, Jake? Oh no, this guy's hmm. kicked the heads on a log. I'm thinking some <laughs> wheels? Okay, dude, hop in me and let's smash that stupid sideways tree. All right, so now we have, All right. well, this is weird. Cause Jake is right here. And then we can spawn in Jake. Time to get my hero on. Well, this is just weird. This is just really, really weird. <laughs> All right, so uh, before we go ahead and do that, we're gonna go ahead and keep breaking some stuff here as much as we can, as much as we can. Ooh. This is, and I know the Midway Arcade Pack was a big level. Like that took me like 40, 50 minutes. So I'm hoping this is just as long. It's gotta contain at least like 19 natures. 19 natures. Oh my. Oh. So I'm just trying to break some stuff. We can actually go. Whoa. Oh whoa. There is a lot that they just sort of walked on by, including cat boxes. Hi, cat box. So wait, they have a miniature area. We'll go ahead and do that for sure. Like I want to be able to get as close as I can on spurs. Why there's so much stuff that they just walked on past? Wow, is this a bridge over here? Oh, it looks like it. <laughs> not quite, not quite. Luckily, Finn runs pretty darn quickly when he gets to full speed here. And what is this right here? Like characters such as we can't do that, unfortunately. Or maybe one day. So there goes 100 <laughs> percent. So we pick up these. And I guess we'll go ahead and do that miniature area, which is pretty cool. I didn't expect that to be there just right at the beginning, so we'll go ahead and do that now. So I'm guessing we're gonna need a partner in crime, so now I'll spawn in Jake. We'll break this open, and we will make Jake small. Get him over here. It's funny, because in Outside to Cal, you wouldn't have to make, and not Jake, Finn. <laughs> we'll make Finn small, but in Outside to Cal, you wouldn't have to make Jake big or small, you know? It's like he'd be able to do all this himself, right? <laughs> That's sort of the funny thing about it. All right, we got that nice and open. Now I can climb back up and then go on this one. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Jake is eating a burger or a sandwich or something. So we can uh, open this one up now. And oh, we don't even need like a larger counterpart to help us out. Do we? I guess not. Hmm, let's pop down here if I can. And okay, there's the kit. Let me switch to you. But why is there, if you guys saw that, uh, there is stuff inside of this sand castle. Wonder how we get in there. Very weird. Well, let me try looking around a little bit. Like, I don't know if there's a way to. Maybe if we make Jake big. He can help out in some way? I'm not sure. Cause this is where the kid came out of. We can fit in here. And then it just doesn't really work out very well for us. 
<laughs> okay, well, what's ever inside the castle seems to be a little bit of a mystery. Oh, I can just jump on across like this. Ah, okay. That wasn't too bad. All right, we don't need Jake anymore for this. We're gonna go ahead and run back and see the actual Jake. This is in front of my plant, okay. Let's we'll go ahead and help out this Jake. Away, look at this pointer sword, I love that. Wee! All right, Jake, how you doing? Okay, oh, we gotta do the, the car, huh? Well, let's do this. And let's see, you wanna save the model to the toy tag, put it in the center. We're running the toy tag, which is nice and good. Toy tag save, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Good stuff. So, um, all right then. Let's go ahead and build this stuff up if we can. Excuse me, pardon me. And this is gonna be, okay, cool. So I don't know how this car drives because it's like, <laughs> it doesn't have any back wheels. That doesn't make any sense. Let's do it. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Some great tra tracking on it though. And Kyridian is. That way. Oh, you can smell it. Dude, you can't smell the book from here. It's in a castle on top of that mountain. In a room. <laughs> Wish you had one, huh? Hmm. This is the first time in Liga Dimensions we've had a conversation with our vehicle, so that's interesting. Yeah, let's start to break stuff with him. I like how he's like, ow, 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 because it hurts. Because he's not actually a car. Oh no, 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 no! Okay, I'm okay. Sorry, Jake. <laughs> we might have exploded him. We might have exploded our good pal. Apparently for not being a car, he actually has some car-like properties. Like, I guess having gasoline in his tank to actually explode. That doesn't make any sense. Hmm. Yeah. Got it. And we're still at 67,000 studs in and not even halfway through the stud meter. There's gonna be a hefty level for sure. But I definitely wanna try to get to it all. Make it enjoyable. Enjoyable indeed. You know, get our time out of this, really. What is this? There's actually a lot of stuff here we can break, including a picnic. Down with the picnic. A uh, boom. Oh no, you've accidentally upset my picnic. I'll just go home and bake another apple pie. Sorry, tree trunks. Bye. <laughs> She's off. Tree trunks is one of the weirdest characters, in my opinion. So there's something to build here. In. But apparently I haven't broken everything that contribute to it. Maybe there's more stuff over here, huh? Looks like it. I can't break this stuff. Weird. Okay, now I can. And what's with the stuff over there that's buildable? I got this. Okay. We got this. We got it. We got it. What is this even? Oh, it's like a, a vault of some sort. Okay. Cool. With real life money inside. Don't really need that myself, but... I'm sure somebody can make use of it. And that's about everything over here. So let's build up this, get on by these evil vines of evilness. The trialing tri tribulations, and we need the car again. All right, Jake Mobile. I mean, we could try the other, I mean, we'll see. We'll see if we need the other vehicle at some point, the uh, the war elephant. Whoa, because they said it in the game, they said that. Oh boy, what is going on? Oh, they're the evil fairies. Oh man, Jake, look, those old women are in mad trub. Oh no. What? Rico OWs are being held hostage. We gotta get those gnomes back into that fire pit, dude. Get them all donked up in there. <laughs> They're gnomes? Okay, we gotta save the old ladies. I think we got some studs to pick up first. But uh, we actually can't use the elephant now because there's still, uh, what's it called to be done? We still gotta be able to um get it. Like, it, it, it's not something we can just sort of put on in. We gotta make sure it gets activated, so. All right, I don't know if we're gonna be able to get the studs in this area afterwards, so I'm trying to get them now while everybody's fighting me. And I don't know if that's a good idea. All right, you guys, you're all going down. You are all going down. There you go. That was good. Oh no, Jake again. So what's going on over here? Oh gosh. They are attacking on ladies, which is like, come on now, you couldn't think of any better prey? What do I do? I just beat him up? Okay, I thought that would be like in a special event I had to do. Nope, just that. No, my you do that, lady. You do that. Algebraic. Alge algebraic. Geometric. Let's save the rest of them. Calculistic. Or whatever. I don't know how you just how you'd make it with calcula. Cal calculus. Ooh. There you go. Uh. Hmm. Oh, you know what? We probably need the grass sword, right? I can only imagine. Um. Wrong button. Uh. Oh, I think he actually already pulled it out. Did he? I guess not. Grass sword. Ready, set, high on. Oh, that works, that works. All right, good stuff. 
Come on. Nice. There you go. Let's save the old lady then. Back. Cheerio, dearie. Oh, wait, where are you going? I don't know what you said there. <laughs> is the car helping? The car, I mean, Jace is sort of driving around. He isn't helping too much. I can't, can't really expect him to, though. Hmm. These guys are everywhere. They just don't stop. They're crazy. Absolutely crazy. Get out of here, gnomes. Why are gnomes bad guys in every video game ever? Oh boy. Let's get all this stuff before more gnomes show up. They don't really look like gnomes, but I guess, I mean, gnomes can be up to the depiction of the of the artist. Artiste? Something like that. Are you my son? Uh, sure. Alright then. Uh, hold on, hold on. Okay, stop hitting me really quick. This is super weird. <laughs> Come on, no, no, no. Got it. But yeah, um, in November, the Wave 7 releases, and of course, I actually have Marceline, which I'm super excited for. Marceline looks really cool. I think that's a fun pack, so that'll be fun to check out. Let's go ahead and do the Demon Sword, just like this. Oh, <laughs> that's all I, I didn't want. I didn't want to attack Jake with it. I just wanted to, you know, do what the Demon Sword does. There you go. The attention, to be honest. I'm sorry, old lady. There's another old lady saved. Oh, oh boy. Son of a bleep loop. Another old lady is being carried off. No! We need those! Television! <laughs> What's so funny about television? I'm not sure. I'm just gonna drive over these guys. You okay? I'm all bummed out about these flying gnomes. Aw oh, man, don't let creeps like that get you down. This place is crazy, Finn. These trials are designed to test your will as well as your strength, apparently. The only way to win is to never give up. So let's go get that book and get out of here. <laughs> yeah. First, I must get all the money in the world. So you gotta wait for me, man. If no, I'm bummed out to be here, apparently. We gotta get stuff done. There's stuff everywhere. Can I? I can. That might make it a little easier. Sometimes when you do that, it'll just give the studs to you. This time it did not. Hmm. These guys are just chilling in here, though. I like that. They're just, ah, new Finn. We'll get you next time, because we're gnomes. This is what we do. We're pretty resilient and doing bad deeds. Hmm. Is there anything off here? There's plenty off here. I might not try to worry about the stray studs as much, because honestly, I don't think that'll tell you up to be too much. But at the same time, we're almost at 100,000, so it's still not even halfway through. I mean, these levels, I'm guessing, are, you know, designed because they're only one level. Usually, the level pack only has one level in them, I'm pretty sure. So. Let's enjoy it. Have fun together. And is that everything for realsies? Looks like for realsies, that's the, the most of everything. So Jake, let's roll, let's roll. yeah, woohoo! I mean, can't you go into ball form and literally roll? That might work. Hey, yeah, yo. Oh, and he broke it for me, thank you. <laughs> Make my job a little bit easier. Bada boom. Okay then, let's take him off this sweet jump. Do a flip ball, you're up there, Jake. Wee! oh, not quite. Or is this last one at? I think there's still two more grandmas to save. Uh, looking like it. Oh no. What are you gonna do with that one, buddy? Leave her alone. Leave her alone, you jerk. I'll give you a whole silver, stud. <laughs> silver stud. That's like what? Worth five studs? Ten studs? She didn't give me the silver. She was a liar. You liar! Ah! <laughs> you lied to me. That's worse than the gnomes. Oh gosh, no, don't pick me up. That's just rude. Gross. All right then, so the last one's over here, right? So we can just hook shot up there. Yes. <laughs> the bus of pain, because the gnomes are evil or something. So we gotta hook shot up here. Ah, I see. We gotta get that, and we're good. We got more stuff to build down there. How are we gonna make like a ladder for her to get down? Maybe we can just catch her? I don't know. Maybe she she won't understand that she has to hop off. Oh, it's a trampoline, isn't it? I think so. And there you go. <laughs> At least she can have some fun. Oh no, is she okay? Oh, I guess she is. <laughs> she was holding her back there for a little bit. Uh oh, what's happening? Oh no! Whoa! Oh my! What is going on? Oh my glob, indeed, oh my glob, oh my glob. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, giant ogre! Oh no, whoa, <laughs> the sweet jump. It's bigger, it's like, dude, I don't know what it's Oh gosh, oh gosh, it's it's pink. Oh, don't kick Jake. 
What am I gonna do here? Let's uh. No, I always press the wrong button. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my giant ogre with the big belly. Seem pretty happy about that. All right, then let's get this. Wait, what is with the big sword? Is that his health bar? That might be his health bar. What is with this like hot dog mobile? Uh, I am not sure. I'm gonna destroy it though. It's gonna give me a kit. I have an idea, Finn. <laughs> Why don't I shrink down inside your belly for belly of the bro mode? No, not again. It's weird when you're in my tum tum. Yeah, you're right, dude. Okay, how do we beat him up then? What? Oh, we just hit him. Okay, that makes sense. Oh wow, we are comboing up on him. That must give him like a toe ache. He does not care. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go for it. No, don't kick me. Yeah, please don't. Please and thank you. Oh, he's gonna go for his other foot now. He's not taking any more damage anymore. Stop, no. Uh, don't point at me. I'll point right back with my sword. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, bats are attacking, or crows. Okay, I guess he's just friends with the crows. Maybe they like pick the bugs off his back or something. And this is sort of a symbiotic relationship. That hurt. I can't even find a place to spawn because he's stomping too much. Here, come on, come on, come on. Hey, you get out of here. We're gonna beat you up. No! Ow! You'd think he'd just walk away. Oh, is he crying now because he lost his ice cream? Okay, we might have to watch out for giant tears falling then. Oh boy, ow! Okay, you almost got me there. No! Nah! <laughs> That's insane. Here, get rid of you. Why don't we try the crouching tiger move? I have no idea what the crouching tiger move is. Ow! We'll probably be too scared to investigate. I don't think tigers live around here, dude. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Come on, let's just shoot him. Oh, that works too. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this because if he's, yeah, you kick all you want. Okay, never mind. Didn't think it was gonna reach me. Oh, there you go. We got him. Oh no, he ain't Jake. No! Oh boy. This is not good. Oh, he took his wallet. <laughs> oh no! Oh gosh, go Jake, go! Oh! <laughs> ah! Stomachs are weird. Indeed they are. I think I remember like the episode this is based on so far. Oh. You're under arrest for stealing my dollar. Just a minute, Jake. Oh, throw it back. Ah. Oh. You know what that was? That was righteous. Thanks, Jake. Yay, righteousness. And we're at a checkpoint. So let's continue oh, on. Man. This place is Puku Spooku. <laughs> Puku Spooku? What does that even mean? <laughs> oh boy. So yeah, we're in a new area now on top of this fortress. I'm sure we skipped a few trials and tribulations by taking this route, but hey, you know what, whatever works. Oh my gosh, what is that? Hello? What in the world are you? Uh, you know what, I, never mind I asked that question. What are you? Can I hit you? Oh, butt traps. <laughs> okay, let's pull up the demon sword. Just like that. I break this thing open. Uh, is this not a demon sword thing? It looks like a demon sword thing. All right, big jumps. Luckily, he can jump super duper high. I love it. It like, makes it nice and helpful. Okay, so let's get this way instead. I have no idea what that giant monster thing was supposed to be, but maybe we'll find out. Can't get this, can I? Oh, no, I can. Just have to shoot it. The music here's a little scary, though. I can tell you that much. Get you. Pick up all of this. No oh my. Can we destroy these? Like some of the stuff looks destroyable. Some of it does not. So it's a little weird. But I definitely want to be able to get the full stun meter just because it's cool to do. But I'm enjoying this so far. I feel like you know, like obviously it's based a lot off of an average Adventure Time episode, so it sort of feels like one. But it also is based off like a specific Adventure Time episode, it seems like, because I remember this episode, I remember the part in the episode where he takes the ogre sing. I remember the part where he puts the guy's head in the key slot, you know, like that kind of stuff. The Enchiridion sounds like a familiar name, that kind of stuff, so. Nothing. This place is pretty high. Can't I just stretch this up with my stretchy body? <laughs> Jake, these are hero tasks. I gotta figure this one out on my own this time. Apparently. All right, so I guess we're doing this for Jake. So I don't know why else we're doing it. Because we already have our way across. I guess if we just have more than one character, we can build up this ladder just like that. It's again, some stuff on the music here is very weird. Like it's just very, very odd. I'm gonna destroy you, yeah. I don't know what that stuff's supposed to be. 
You wanted something? Another Harry Potter area! What the heck was that? What is, uh, yeah, is this only a Harry Potter area? Harry Potter and Voldemort. It just plays a lot of, uh, a lot of favor to those guys, Harry Potter and Voldemort. I mean, they are brand new with Wave 6 as well, and I guess that's the idea. All right, so I broke this open. What was down here, though? There was that, but I don't know if we should head into there just yet. Like, that seems too obvious, right? Like, that's gonna bring us to the next area? Oh, no, it's not, okay. Huh. So we can build something up here now. I just wanted to build, just wanted to build. Don't worry, don't worry. Give me these studs. Give me the ability to build. Just like... What is this? Oh, is it just... Ah, oh, it's one of these again. And they just give you a bunch of studs? Cool, cool. Okay. Anything off to shoot around here? I can shoot these, so I will take the opportunity. And then we're gonna back up there. Okay, now we're up here. And there's, what is this? This is like stinky stuff. Some kind of stinky stuff over here. I don't think we can do it. Maybe, I think Scooby-Doo can dig this stuff up. I don't know if any other character can. Maybe we'll find out some. Wait, can't, wouldn't Jake be able to, since he's a dog too? We'll find out. Get this party started. Uh, no. <laughs> I'm overestimating Jake, apparently. <laughs> take it. Time to get this party started. Time to go take a quick nap. Just a quick little nappy. Oh my. Evil skeleton! Do that! That was my home! Police! Police! No, don't call the police! Don't do it! Oh no! Car <laughs> police skeletons! This isn't good! No, quickly build! With the zip. <laughs> I love their like little slang language. It's so cute. There you go, I got times three, even though I picked up all the studs in the area, so it's not too helpful. Platform! Yeah! Man, this place is so spiced! <laughs> what did I just say? This place is so spiced! So spicy! Mm -mm, maybe a little too spicy. Ow, my mouth hurts. Somebody please stop the agony. Alright, build this up. Imagine if that, that sounds like an adventure time place. Like, you just go there and it's like the land of spicy mounds. So the moment you're there, it's like you just ate like a really hot pepper. And it's like, and everything else is fine. It's like totally like real life. But, but besides that, you know, it's just like, it's spicy mouth. What is with this dude? He's just like, hey, Finn, I have something to tell you. It's absolutely nothing. Okay, well, I'm just gonna take everything else around here. And I'm guessing whatever was behind that Harry Potter locked area is something related to him. Like it'll only make sense, right? Let's break this, because I know half the studs. Oh, can we not? I guess I have to start relating this thing. We'll probably fall off. Yep. No, it wasn't much at all. Okay, getting up here, getting up here. So I guess that what we're doing right now is maybe setting things up so if we did have an extra character with us, they could follow us. Cause I'm thinking that we're gonna have to to solve these trials we're given to get a mystical book that's hidden. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I just love how it could automatically go into auto tune mode. Like that doesn't make too much sense. Like maybe I think there may have been like an explanation for that. I can't remember. I'm gonna open you up and read what you're all about. Wow. <laughs> about wow. Mm, yeah. You have to help you. Hooray! Help! Ah! Oh gosh, too close! <laughs> um. <laughs> So I guess now Jake can come up. <laughs> I guess that was a lot of help. Thank you, lady. Well, I hope she enjoys her life as a freed ghost. For now, we must pick up studs. Maybe she'll become like like the leader of a ghost opera. That'd be cool. I hope she has a fun ghost life. What do I do here? This is odd. Um, huh, maybe there is something I missed. Oh, I see, if we move this back, it'll activate a bridge there and and that's why we're using the ladder. That makes sense. That makes sense indeed. <laughs> now let's get back up there. And now yeah, we can go back up here. Cool stuff. So what is like, I don't know, I wanna bunch of, ask a bunch of Adventure Time questions. Your favorite Adventure Time character, your favorite Adventure Time episode. I have like, I, I can't say what my favorite Adventure Time character is because I love them all. Like there's really not many that I dislike, you know? Either it be the Lemon Guy, or Finn, or Jake, or Marceline, or the Flame Princess, or Princess Bubblegum, or Ice King. They all have like a good balance of everything. So what's going on here? Am I moving this to green? I guess I'm moving this to green to do something green related over here. I was never too familiar with this power up. Yeah, we're doing something, right? Maybe. I have no clue, actually. Uh. Oh, okay. Whoa. 
Okay. That'll get us over there. I'll take it. Yeah, now they're a little disorienting, though. <laughs> Can't see much when I'm just covered in leaves and stuff. But we can get over here, though, real quick, maybe. Just pick up some of these extra studs. Get that studage going on. Oh, oh. No, come on, you can do it. Yeah, you did it. Good stuff, good stuff. Hmm. Let's get back over here. What's going on with this? Oh, the doors are opening, and they have nothing. <laughs> oh, this looks like the elephants. Very cool. How can you smell the milk for the store when you're way down there? Damn, the more elephant. Yeah, we'll go and put that into the game in a second once it actually gives us the offer to. But for right now, we're gonna get some suns. No, why'd you have to do that, Jake? Or Finn, you know. Okay, let's just see what we have to do here. Okay, yeah, it's gonna ask us to spawn in the elephant, so I'm just gonna skip through all this because we already built it in a video earlier. And then I press okay, and then I put it in the center, and then I press okay again, and my war elephant is being built. <laughs> that looks weird, it has the little things there that aren't on mine. Weird, okay. So, where are you, war elephant? Oh, it flies? Yeah, the war elephant? We can use APTWE to laser those gold walls. What? APTWE? What does that mean? I have no clue, but this is cool. I like it. And then what about up here? Oh, I went over here. We got something. Why are you? Fl why are you going down? How do I fly up? I don't know how to fly up. No, that's bringing me down. No, that's okay. How do I go up? Because I'm pressing X and it brings me down. What? Yeah, you can say that again. Okay, never work for man. All right, so let's get up here, because the elephant can only fly downwards. I press X and it just brings me down. Oh, look, there's the, there's the snail up there again. Just waving to me, he's so adorable. I love him. He might be my favorite character, actually. I read it everything, and Bimo, and then it's, you know, Lumpy Space Prince. There's too many good characters in Adventure Time. How dare I be able to think of just one that might be the best? They're all tied. We get another one of these things. Or do you think they just give us a bunch of studs and instead they give us a brick that gives us studs? Oh, that was a, oh, if I hit it at the right time, I get more studs. That's how those things work. Is that it? I think that's it. Let's just push that over there. And I'm gonna push this over here. Move, question block. I can't solve the puzzle if, you know, the puzzle answer is in the way. <laughs> hey, let's go in. Evil guy? Oh my, he does look evil. Okay, I'm gonna get the, the war elephant out of here. As you would expect with an elephant, he is sort of getting in the way. <laughs> okay, I got my sword at the ready, which is a little weird seeing how I gotta be able to move around properly. Come on, break it off. Oh, I need my demon sword here is the thing to get past it. So let's go ahead, pull that up. What about the fin sword? The sword on the bottom. We haven't used those at all. You must be truly righteous to have made this far. I guess so. Huh, thank you. All right, let's speed this stuff up. So this guy actually seems pretty confident now in us, in our righteousness, which is pretty cool. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, how zebratastic am I? I hope maximum. Could you, could you come over here, please? This only works if you're close. I'll be over there soon, evil guy. You know what's an evil guy without a little bit of evil patience? What? I will show you oh no! 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 That you're not entirely aware. Oh no! What is is this thing? Is it a heart? This is a heart. Am I? I think it's a heart. Ew! All right, we're beating up a heart with legs, and it has a robotic arm. Sure. Anything that's evil. That's my deal. All right, well, I'm gonna shoot it. I don't think shooting does anything at this stage of the fight. Why does it just have a robotic arm? Oh no, oh no, 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 no. There, put it there, put it there. So we just gotta wait for him to spin, and then when he spins, he gets dizzy, and then we start hitting him, I guess. I know, he's available now. He's available to get destroyed. I'm gonna hit him in his heart butt. <laughs> this is so weird. Come on, there you go, got him a little bit more. Come on, get out of here, oh, that hurt. That hurt a lot, he's an electrical one too. I get it, dude. I love how his mouth is just floating around, though. He's very happy about this. Come on, 
Is he gonna get all spun out? <laughs> it looks like he is. Okay, he's fallen. Get him again. I'm gonna be able to get him under half health here, which is good. Ooh, okay, get out, get out, get out. Oh no, he got out. This is nuts. What? I'm trying. <laughs> Don't rush me. You know, slaying beasts is an art form. It takes time. You gotta respect that. Slay the be a beast or some, something like that. Just do it already, kid. <laughs> All right, he's gonna spin himself out in a second. Come on, come on, get out of here. No, please stop. Oh boy. All right, now is my chance. Meet him up, meet him up good, meet him up good. Oh gosh, he's getting super low. Okay, we just need one more round with him and I think we'll be fine. Oh my. Oh, whoa. Come on, dude. We got this, we got this. Not a problem. Oh. No, 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 wait, wait, what are you doing? Okay, they have this thing again. We got it, no problem. So a lot of this you really can just do with Finn. Like there really wasn't too many things where I had to spawn another character except for stinking Harry Potter or Voldemort. The only two characters I don't seem to have anymore. Now, as one last, last trial, <laughs> slay this ant. No. Is it evil? No, but it's not good either. It's uh, neutral. Will you slay it? No. No! Never, never, never! Never! Oh, oh my. Congratulations, Finn the human. Now you have truly reached the end. Yeah. Oh gosh, no! Oh, oh no, Mr. Keeper, uh, I'm sorry. What? Why are you wearing that little devil costume? Oh, these are my pajamas. I was just getting ready for bed. <laughs> Finn, Jake, you made it. Oh. I'm Manish Man, the Minotaur. Hi. <gasps> the manly Minotaur from Princess Bubblegum Story. Oh. <laughs> oh, look so, at him flex. Can I check out the Enchiridion? Can I, can I, can I? Yeah, come on, let's check it out. Woohoo! Yay. Oh, boy, <laughs> you ready for this? Whoa! The Enchiridion! <laughs> hey, crack open that book and read something for fun's sake, all right? Yeah! Whoa! <laughs> what? You gotta be flipping kidding me! Check it, dude! 100% awesomeitude! <laughs> <laughs> that is cool! <laughs> all right then, so I don't know. <laughs> That's it. Adventure time with Venom Jake! Is there still more, though? I wonder. It looks like there is. Jake, what am I supposed to be meditating about? Don't know. I'm thinking of pillows stuffed with spaghetti. Clear your minds. <sighs> mind is cleared. <laughs> that is not a clear mind. That is not a clear mind. That is also not a good. None of you are going to be meditating. I have to go check on something. Can we go with? Perhaps you are ready to go with. Oh, baby, yeah, baby, 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 yeah, baby, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, thanks for the clap. It's Peppermint Man. Oh. Can we come with? No? Oh, she's just gonna float around? Okay, I guess we gotta keep up the hard way. So we are not done here. This is odd. I thought that was gonna be it. I guess not. I guess there's another level to enjoy here. I will follow you in a second. Don't rush me. We gotta do something with wild style over here. Come on, come on. I'm wild. All right, then. You ready? Boop. And then you gotta do something here. All right, then. And then you can get out of here. I'm not gonna. I knocked Bemo over. Rest in peace. Uh, you can do something. Do -de do 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 do. What is it? <laughs> Oh, we need Lumpy Space We can do that. We got Lumpy Space Princess. Don't don't you worry about that. Okay, just I know, I know, I know. Hold on, hold on. I'm just getting the studs first. Same level though, same stud meter. All right, let's get Lumpy Space Princess in here. And let's go ahead and check this out. Go on down. <laughs> oh my, so it goes. Oh, I just got, oh, that stinks. That stinks indeed. All right then, is that all I can do around here? Man, so I, I didn't know that was a thing. I thought it was just some weird blinky blink. <laughs> Gonna get the lump out of here! Michaela can do a really good lumpy space princess voice. Oh, there you go. 
Nice stuff. Use the gold panel to get behind that secret curtain. Just be careful not to activate the security system. I'll do my best. I thought I probably should have given you a bubble too. But alas, Peppermint Butler has taken his leave for the night. For the night? Hey, I'll figure it out. How much do you pay this guy? <laughs> Must not be too much. So I guess we are building this just in case we had other people we were playing with, but it's sort of a weird idea, I guess. Oh no, unless we we're supposed to go back. I have no clue. I'm hearing people make noises. I don't know where, where those noises are coming from. Oh, right here. Hello, Cinnamon Bun. No, Cinnamon Bun! I hope you're okay, buddy. I rest in peace to you as well. Everybody's dying on me. I need more friends, because they're all dying. <laughs> all right, let's do this. Explode the gold. Yes, now we can open up this. And I mean, this is definitely how we're gonna get through because- I am missing integral oh. parts of my programming, including my friend or foe detector. So I'm going to have to guess, uh, enemy. No, no, I'm not, oh I'm a God. good guy. The Gumball Guardian has gone completely bananas. It thinks we're an intruder. I am also seemingly missing my aiming plugin. Could you be a pal and please walk into my laser? Well, if I were to not walk into your laser, would I still be a good guy? Or would that just make me dumb? Okay, so I guess I can build something over here. Is this gonna make a mirror? What is this? Uh. Okay, fin sword. Oh, cool. There you go, just aim it back. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Well, we did it. We took out the gumball man. Rest in peace to you. To see everybody's dying. This is a horror story. Is that all we can do around here? What is this up here? I have no clue what we can shoot at. Yeah. What, are the, what, what was that? Who knows? Who knows? I'm getting out of here. Oh, and we can build something else. Okay, Jake Mobile is gonna have to be ready. Actually, maybe we should spawn in some of the other stuff that we haven't tried out yet, like the Lumps, Lumpy Space Princess card. Oh, I can't do that one yet. Um, Instead, where is the other one? Oh yeah, BMO. We already did BMO. I don't know if BMO will work. Okay, I have to try BMO. Will BMO work as a car here? Ah, oh, she won't. Oh, that stinks. All right then. Looks like we're doing this one instead. Doing it. Ooh. Okay, so we're just getting some more platforming things going on here. Excuse me. Bottom, he's just floating now. That's where we're going, we're going over here. Also, this of course brings me back, whoa. Oh my, I gotta pull this, okay. Of course, this does bring me back to the Adventure Time Little Big Planet DLC. If you guys don't know, that actually released like sometime in 2015, I think, was some Adventure Time. It was Adventure Time level for Little Big Planet 3. It was a lot of fun when we did that. That was also just like a one level thing, and of course, you get the pack and everything, which was very cool. So let's get up here if we can. Oh no, I think we can though. No, really? Huh? I wonder how we can get up there. Then maybe we need a higher jumper or something. Weird. All right, well, there's that. Can we get anything else up here? There is a blue stead waiting for us. All right, worker slamming. Yeah, okay. So what is this about? Oh, now we can teleport to those different areas. So hopefully we can teleport to that one. We got one up there. We got the, ah, here you go. Here you go, I'm going over there now. Are you ready? Cause I'm ready to get myself a redemption. I got the least valuable one last time. Before that, I got the most valuable one. So it goes, like there's no pattern to it. No, I got the least valuable one again. <laughs> I'm bad at that. I am genuinely horrible. All right, hold on a moment. Let's go to the purple one then, because that's the only one I can't, like I haven't gone to yet. There you go. Candy barn, free candy. Cool. You're doing great. Now see if you can find a way up here. I'll be waiting for you. Come on, dude, we can't keep PB waiting. It's always weird, in my opinion, everybody's fascination with candy. Don't get me wrong, candy is good and treats are good, but at the same time, it's like, I've never been a big sweets person. Like, I like a sweet occasionally. Like, there are these strawberry things that I really like, that are really nice, even though they're more of like a snack than they are candy. I mean, I'd see them as candy. But, uh, oh, stop, okay, I gotta stop thinking that's gonna get me anywhere. Pancakes are knocking me back. But it's just like one of those things where it's like, I see it as something I have very rarely. Well, see, some people, a lot of people seem like they want candy and treats and stuff every single day. But if I have it, it's like, I just, it feels like I haven't eaten food, but I'm not hungry, so I just feel sick. Does that make sense? Okay, I'm just spinning this right round. There you go. Alley-oop! 
Oh, no. <laughs> a little off the mark there for that one. Okay, hopefully this is a little better. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, okay, I survived. Read you cannot pass from Monday to Friday. However, you may not be able to pass on Saturday or Sunday, too, as I will be replaced by another guard, and I don't know what his task is, I imagine. Oh, look at this now in the background. We got chocolate banana guards. Sunday, instead of Monday to Friday. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. I'll put it, I'll write it down in my schedule. Uh, where do we go? Oh my, whoa, how, where, how are we here now? That's really nuts. Beyond Iceberg Lake lies the ruins of the Lich's Tower. Hi! Where he was converting the planet's life force into unholy power to destroy oh no. all of the snail. But before he could, the legendary Billy attacked him and pummeled him into the resin of this tree. No! Snail, no! No, don't do it! What the nuts? Oh no. I'm starting to remember this episode too. Be a big sword. Oh, okay. I'll try. Oh gosh, this might not work. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no! Oh gosh, this isn't good. There's only one known weapon that can harm the Lich. The Gauntlet of the Hero. Billy! Old beef fingers. Quickly now, Finn. Track the Lich by his trail of death. Okay, whatever, whatever. Here I go. Here I go. Yeah, yeah, I remember that Billy has six fingers. Oh, the snail's okay now. What have you done? Oh, you didn't mean it. Poor snail. Okay, we gotta go defeat this lich. What is going on here? Oh, wow. He's much better at those than we are, apparently. Wow, he's huge, though. All right, now we gotta do it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, they're happy about an adventure, yeah! <laughs> Awesome stuff. First fate of the world deal. Yeah, man. We gotta shut this fool down hardcore. Yeah, and if, oh, what? We fell through the little hole? Come on. Yeah, man. Alright, it's our first fate of the world deal, as Jake said. Cool stuff. I'm loving this so far. This level kit is great. I gotta do something here first. Okay, hold down. Okay, so hold down circle. And we gotta use Billy's gauntlet. Is this something we keep for good? Because that'd be cool. And then I can do something here, right? No, that just killed me. Oh no, we, we, we found the gauntlet. What's going on here? So hold down circle and then select the wheel. Yeah, and then what? And then, and then what? How do I get across here? Oh, come on, you can't just give me that little information. Maybe I can just shoot it? No, I didn't want that, I wanted to I'm doing this, but it doesn't seem to be making a noise. Maybe I can shoot this stuff up there. and Maybe that'll make a difference? No, 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 I can't reach it. I can't stink and reach it because the ball soul is in the way. Okay, now I can reach it. Oh, there you go. Okay, that seemed to work. We just have to stand really far away. See ya. And that's one out of four. Okay, I'll have to keep that in mind. This area is so cool. I love this. Okay, this is a little scary, don't you think? Maybe we can just destroy it. I can just destroy it. Okay, then I don't have to worry. Destroy all this stuff too while we're at it. Oh, maybe. Maybe some of this stuff is unbreakable. Give me that blue set then. hi -ya! Okay, now we can break it. <laughs> oh gosh, the giant scissors of doom. Luckily, we don't actually have to do any obstacle coursing. We can just destroy everything. That sort of, doesn't that the, the, what is that down there? Is that the, oh, that's the lemon guy. You can see the lemon guy down there. Okay. Maybe we'll be able to get to do something with him soon. Here, can I, uh, no, I wanted to uh, let's switch to the crossbow. Get that out and ready. And then go. Yep, just like that. Come on, come on, let's break these scissors. I thought the point of the obstacle course was for it you know, to be obstacles and maneuver around, but instead, it is not. Can we destroy these things as well? Uh, Not looking like it. <laughs> All right, boom. That does not work as well as the gauntlet does. No, Jay got exploded. Here, hold on, hold on. I'm trying to get the gauntlet. It's not working out fabulously right now. The animation takes too long. I'm missing out on the studs. Oh boy. So there's some gold stuff up there that we can destroy the gauntlet. The gauntlet's a nice touch. I just hope that we get to keep this for the adventure world, because that would make Jake a really good character. Oh, I gotta do the outline, all right then. But I'm not sure, do we get, does he keep it in his actual show? I can't remember. 
It's been too long. I definitely need to catch up on Adventure Time. I don't know if the new seasons have been good, but I haven't heard anything bad about them, so I can only assume they're great. It's, it's, people complain about things when they're bad more than they praise things when they're good. So I can only assume that the fact that I haven't heard too much about Adventure Time means that it's been going pretty well. <laughs> All right, so it looks like this is the last thing we need to defeat here. Because, you know, it's been out of four. This is the fourth thing. Okay, so let's try to go now, go now, go now, go down. And then, yeah! <laughs> I'm happy about it too. You can this puzzle's pute? Is it a puzzle or an obstacle course? To me, it seems more like an obstacle course. So we broke it, oh my. Oh gosh, it's getting a little weak. And we, we're fine, we're fine. Oh, there's the kit, it's waiting for us. So I guess that we could have continued on for speed's sake and not have gotten a kit, but I will take the kit route, please and thank you. So we're at 222,000 studs and we almost have the stud meter all the way filled, which is some great stuff. We're definitely not getting every kit, but we've gotten three out of 10 so far. Some of these, you know, kits are pretty tough though. All right, I'm getting it, I'm getting it. I'm getting as much as I can, as much as I can. And then let's, Jake Mobile's nice and spun. He's been just following me around, which is great. And bada boom, there's another kid for us. And oh gosh, that did not work. What? Wait, what? How are we here? Okay, I'm a little confused. How are we here? Um. Bing bong, ping bong. All right, we're going against some enemy skeletons. At least they're not evil gnomes. That makes it much better. Much, much better. Okay then, get this stuff, and there's that rule breaker. Now I'm just gonna focus on the skeletons. Joe, you're in mathematical, yeah! <laughs> oh boy, it's so cool. Dude, why don't we hide in a hole, then when the enemy says, hey, are you in that hole? I punch them down into the hole, and when they land, you can punch them again, just to be safe. We call it jitty hole. I don't know about that, dude. Holes like that take a while to dig. We could just like, uh, hit them real hard instead. Mm, good point. Good point indeed. So we need to charge Ghostbuster for that one. I think that's what it'll tell me, right? Such as her and just her. But uh, we have heard, we just actually have been posting our Ghostbusters adventure area video. So you can show, check those out if you haven't already because they're nice and fun. It looks like there's gonna be some stuff here, but you know what I'm gonna do then? I'm gonna press the wrong button as always. We gotta switch to the Billy's Gauntlet. And then we gotta line it up with this and let's trace the outline. Nice and fine, nice and good. But this area is so cool. I love how true it is to the Adventure Time. It's funny because usually in these Lego games, you'll see that they parody a lot of the cutscenes. But this game is so silly. I'm not this game. This show is so silly on its own. It's hard to parody something more than it's already been parodied. So it's almost just like a one for one about its cartoon, which is very interesting. I thought there was going to be a full original story, but honestly, I don't mind it being like remade Adventure Time, you know, t like shows or episodes. So yeah, I'm happy about it. Was there somebody in there? Oh gosh, there's Cinnamon Bun. What is Cinnamon do Bun doing out here? In these abandoned subways of past yesteryear. I'm not entirely sure. You guys, whoa, -ho, what was that? Finn's getting a little more powerful, I gotta say. Holy cow. Oh, and here's the charge, so we could make our way all the way back for it. We might as well, right? Let's just go ahead, I have her somewhere. Right here. Abby, you're going into a world you might not understand. But that's okay. Uh, the Ghostbusters are here. Well, we got skeletons, not quite ghosts, but they'll, they, I mean, you could bust them. You could just punch them, that busts them. So let's go back normally, and let's go and fill that up with the electricity. Now, guys, don't follow me on the subway. You don't have a ticket, I knew you. If you don't have a ticket, I'm gonna bust you. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna charge this over here and see what happens. Come on, nope, come on. Ooh, got it. Oh, and it just gives me the kit? Why is it in a hollow cup? All right, uh, how do I get it out of the cup though? This is bizarre. Maybe it has the Lego Dimension symbols on it, so maybe I need to be able to do other stuff. You're gonna get Chinese food, have fun with that, bye. You see this right here? I think that we still have some things yet to solve. <laughs> Jake's getting beat up right now by the skeletons. The ton of skeletons. So yeah, you see how it leads down here though? Hmm. Interesting. I don't know. This one's a little puzzling, ain't it? My inside voice is telling me we have to go this way. Finn. Are you sure your inside voice doesn't have a case of poo brain? Poo no, brain? Dude, my inside voice is poo free. It's still mad virtuous. Mad virtuous. 
Alright, let's go through here. I think we might want to go and check out that train area where, uh, oh gosh, is that a, that's a bomb. That's right, there used to be a war, wasn't there? Like, this is, I think Adventure Time's post-apocalyptic. You know, it's been determined as at this point. But we can, can we go in here? We can't. Huh. Very peculiar for sure. Alright, I'm just gonna go over here, though. And enjoy what we're doing, whatever that may be. Going through here. <laughs> I really shouldn't be focusing so much on picking or breaking random stuff now. I should just be keeping on making with some progress. So like skeletons being destroyed, that's the progress I wanna make. Oh, that combo, he's so good at beating up enemies. That's a crazy thing. Oh, this is something Raven can do. I don't know if there's gonna be a Teen Titans level pack, but they're stinking better be. They're, they're stinking better be. Is, is Raven the only one who can do it? Hmm, okay then, well, then I'm gonna get, you know, throw in the towel with that one. No way we can do it because we don't have Raven. I don't know if Raven's out yet. I'm pretty sure she isn't. All right, what's going on here? Uh, only characters such as whoever that is. I have no clue. All right, we're going back this way. The skeletons just won't stop. They can't stop, they won't stop. What is in this trash can? The trash can was moving itself. That was a little weird. Okay, I won't over here. I like I didn't say nothing. And we're just gonna build all this stuff back up. Oh, it's gonna be another sword puzzle. We got it. Not a problem. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Nope, I, I'm pressing the wrong buttons. All of the wrong buttons shall be pressed. And now we can go up here. Keep chasing that lich. Or not. Um, this is not what we're supposed to be doing. Oh, I guess we're supposed to just be breaking that open. And now we can do this thing. Uh, we get to choose? What in the world is going, this looks like it's gonna be a little confusing. Um. What do I do? What do I do? I'm apparently tracking the lich. Wait, I have the question block here. Let's first do this one. I don't know why I'm doing this one, but I don't know, I am so confused. Oh, you know what, this is how we unlock the one thing. I don't know, that's gonna take too much time. What about the other one? What is with the slowdown one? To locate, the, lo the locate keystone, the locate keystone can be used to find lost objects from other dimensions. Follow the lights on the toy pad, uh, and the the closer you get to a hidden object, the greener the lights get. Oh, really? Green? Okay, so we're looking for green. I'm looking at the light pad or the toy pad right now. If I go down to the left, it gets more green. Oh, now it's getting yellow again. Um, like this, right? But what about other things? Oh, it's getting greener over here. Like this. But like. I want like actual stuff that's gonna progress me through the level, like stuff I can actually do. What do I do about that? Whoa, okay, we found it. Weird. Okay, I don't think we've ever used this one before. Whoa. Look at that. Okay, we got another dimension. Oh, there he is, I think. Oh no, that was the old Ice King. Wow. What is going on? I have no clue. We just got exploded. Oh, we got cut off. The lich. There he is. Oh my. All right, lich. This is the checkpoint. I'm gonna take you on. This is a crazy long level so far. Like I don't know if I'm gonna be splitting this up in the parts or not. All right. What are we gonna do about all this? We got the lich who's just shooting at us. The Jake Mobile is gonna protect me for a little bit. A joke. Rude. That's just, just, just uncourteous. How are we gonna take him out, though? Well, that's what I'm trying to figure out. We're probably gonna need the uh, Billy's Gauntlet, so. Oh gosh, there he goes. No, his thing almost fell there. His shield almost fell, but then he just brought it immediately back up. I don't know if that was supposed to be how it's supposed to be. No, don't don't extinguish all, please. Don't, don't do that. Oh, oh! Okay, what did that do? Was that a chainsaw? Okay, wait, wait. It sings, sometimes it'll go down, sometimes it won't. That was really weird. Oh, I died. <laughs> I have full stun meter, I don't care. I've been working really hard for that. Oh. Well, we're gonna run back over this way and try to destroy whatever else we can find. Whatever else we can find around here. Oh. There we go, now he's finally. Oh, yes. Oh. We didn't get much time there. This guy's gonna be tough then. If he's gonna just, you know, give us that little of time. All right. 
All right, I'm just gonna drive in the car and drive around then. Come on, Jake, we can do this. No, we're stuck. Okay, maybe this was a bad idea. Whoa, whoa. So we just sort of gotta distract him, right? Take care of all the skeletons. I'm guessing that like he doesn't trigger anything until we take care of every skeleton. So I'm gonna do that as quickly as I can. He's gonna start coughing, right? He needs this ooze, though. Seems like the ooze is pretty darn important to him. <laughs> so we're gonna, oh no, Jake! I miss you, buddy! You're the end. Is that why you need a, you know, a slurp of Mountain Dew over there? Oh boy. Stop breaking everything, just rude. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, luckily these guys are super easy with the Enchiridion. There you go. All right, he's coughing. Oh, is he getting his drink? All right, let's just start punching him like this. This might actually end up doing more damage. Yeah, we almost have him down halfway. This is really good. Wow, we are doing so much to him right now. Wow, okay, ow, 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 ow. Rude. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. There you go, I got it. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Please enjoy what is left of your short life before I destroy you. Well, our life will be a lot longer if we can destroy you, so that's what I'm gonna focus on here, buddy. Not more skellies. Oh, maybe we need the Ghostbusters, actually. I mean, this guy is pretty ghostly. Maybe the Ghostbusters know a thing or two. Okay, hold on, hold on. Oh. I don't know about that. I feel like you're just a pessimist, is all. It's not that we have, you know, a legitimate problem. It's that you're just, you know, sort of down in the dumps. I mean, I'm here to talk if you want, but you can't try to kill me while we talk. That's sort of the problem. Okay, whoa. Hold on, that that was uncool. That was uncalled for. All right, so, no, no, no. Thought he was gonna take a drink there. He's coughing. Okay, we already heard him say that. Okay, hey, don't knock me back into the ooze. The ooze might be your thing, but it is not mine. Come on, get you out of here. Get this one over here, maybe? Nope. <laughs> okay, come on, let's go over there and get him. Get over there and get him. This might, oh my gosh, I stink at the game. Oh, no, 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 Jake, move! Jake, we don't need you right now. We don't need to be driving nowhere. So get out of the way. <laughs> Come on, can we get him? Can we get him? Can we get him? No! Okay, he's still he's still kicking. I probably could have gotten him if Jake wasn't in the stinking way. I know, I'm moving him. I'm moving him over here. Okay, he's coughing, he's coughing. Up. You might just need to go see a doctor. Instead of, you know, self-medicating with this ooze stuff, why don't you just go see, like, you know, an actual doctor, physician, something, you know? Maybe that's your problem. Maybe this stuff has adverse health defects. Like, what even isn't? Uh, well, same to you too, then, buddy. Merry Christmas. Ooh. No, ow, that hurt. <laughs> Come on, we can get you. We can get you. Oh, sort of. Yeah. I wish I could just punch him with the gauntlet, but that doesn't really work, does it? All right, so he's gonna, oh no, Jake again. Every time that happens, it feels so much more dramatic than it actually is. All right, he's gonna raise one more round of these guys, make a little bit more of the ground fall. There it goes, there it goes. Get rid of you and you guys over here. Hey, don't be doing that yet, Jake. Guard me, protect me, you can do it. All right, now he must be getting out. Uh, yeah, he's gonna get, you know, more of his Ooh, this is where we're gonna destroy him and the Lich King! Oh, he's flying away. What is happening? He flipped gravity. Okay, this is not good. Uh, if we're fighting a guy who can flip gravity and he didn't use it until the very end, it must mean that he has a large arsenal of tricks. Oh, neat. So it looks like we need to break this stuff. Like, what is this stuff we're gonna do that's gonna help us stay out of sight? You would think that, like, we're not just gonna run away because you just threw us on the ceiling, but no, no, no. Get out of here with all of these pieces. We need to put them all into one piece. What is this? Is this the world's scariest chandelier? No, it's not. <laughs> bigger Billy's gauntlet. Yeah, time to finish this. Even bigger Billy's gauntlet. Oh, it's gonna punch him. Punch, nice. That must've hurt you, Noggin. What do you gotta say now? Plan on taking this guy out. I got a sick plan. I'm a cat. I'm an agile cat. <laughs> <laughs> now he's a cat. Oh boy. Oh boy. Punch him. Oh, nice. And down he goes. The lich is destroyed. Jake. Jake. Oh, Finn. You did it. Hey. Hey. Yeah. We did it. 
Oh, you guys, this experience has brought us all so much closer together. <laughs> oh, no. I'm so alone. Won't somebody tell me what's wrong with me? Anybody? 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 You're a cold-hearted sociopath. <laughs> right on the money button. <laughs> oh. Well, that was a little rude, but adventure time! Another episode completed! Is that it? I think that's it on this time. The fun will never end. There you go. A book and a bad by bad guy. <laughs> bad by bad guy complete. And there you go. There was the complete Adventure Time level pack. About like an hour of Adventure Time fun there. I enjoyed myself and hopefully you did too. If we skip, I think we'll get one last cutscene. So let's see if we do and let's check it out. Come on, skip all this. We got the rule breaker. I know. We got ourselves a few kits. We got four of them. I'm sure there's plenty to get though, so. Not gonna worry about it for right now. We're just gonna go ahead and continue. So it looks like we're flying back to the adventure area now, which we won't worry about too much, but I guess that's it. There's no exiting cutscene, but that's A-OK, -okay, because we had a blast. There was so much stuff. If you guys want me to adventure this adventure world, see what's within it, some kind of the cool stuff we could do, maybe explore the treehouse, candy kingdom, or whatever else we could find around here. Looks huge and awesome, I love it. But for now, Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video on LEGO Dimensions. If you did, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watch this point of video, make sure you comment Adventure Zebra so now you've watched the end of the video, and now you're a Zebra-tastic viewer. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!